Good morning, everyone. It is Tuesday. It's a little bit later in the day. It's about 10 o'clock right now. I kind of slept in a little bit. Last night, I was up till past two o'clock in the morning finishing all my DIYs for tomorrow's video. <laughs> I try not to stay up as late. Um, I really don't like it. But since I was pretty much away the entire weekend, I had to wait till yesterday to start on my DIYs. The good thing is I already had everything, about 99% of everything that I needed, um, and I knew exactly what I was gonna do. So that made it easier, but obviously since I can't just work straight through the day, I have to break up my day, it usually ends up me working in the evening. <laughs> Um, but I'm excited. I, right now I have my hair and makeup done for my video intros and outros that I need to do for that video tomorrow. So I just need to do my introduction like normal and kind of talk about the girls. So I have two girls on the collaboration with me tomorrow, which will be nice because it's been a little while since I've collaborated with them. And um, I've known them since the beginning of my YouTube, you know, career. So it'll be nice to do something different um, with some, you know, other girls for a change. And um, so the kids are actually already doing their work. Nelson got up earlier and got them started with schoolwork. I need to go ahead and just have a quick breakfast so that I can get my day started. I've got a few things I've got to take, get done. So yeah, so it's, it's gonna be another busy one. What you got there, bud? Um, a $5 bucks. Five dollar bucks. <laughs> yes. Um, the tooth fairy must have come. Um, when I looked under my pillow, it wasn't there. But when we saw under the bed, it was. Oh Maybe yeah. Maybe it was because you know how I move a lot when I go to sleep. <laughs> I'm gonna save this for when we go to our Chattanooga trip. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, let's save yeah, it. Yeah. So I can save it for the gift shop. Like we always get stuff at the gift shop. Okay. That sounds good. <laughs> All right. Save it, buddy. Okay. <laughs> so the Tooth Fairy is very generous every time they have like their first. So they get $5 for their first tooth and then they get $5 for their first molar. That was his first molar. Everything else is a dollar. <laughs> the Tooth Fairy ain't that rich. But um, but yeah, no, he was excited this morning. He, he couldn't find it though because the tooth was gone but the money wasn't there and it apparently had fallen like behind the mattress and underneath the bed because he moved so much so yeah that was nice for him to find this morning so my entire house right now is quite a bit of a mess and i have my little setup right there i'm about to do my intro and outro for my video um i just cleared up that little section right there and i'm just going to record because i've got to get that out of the way and then i can just clean up the rest of the house and get sweaty because i don't like to get done for a video and then sweat and my makeup gets all you know messed up and then what's the point right so i like to get my intro and outro done first before i clean or do anything i've already got my shirt on and i'm just gonna set it up get it done and over with and i've got a lot more stuff over there that i've got to go through <laughs> yeah because i've been so busy the past several days and over the weekend i wasn't here pretty much um I haven't done anything around the house, so the house is an absolute mess. And honestly, just sometimes you just have to let those things kind of go and slide until you can get to them because there definitely are other things going on and I can't overwhelm myself too much. Several years ago, I would have gone absolutely insane <laughs> and I would have made sure that my house is always spick and span because even with three kids, I've always liked a really clean and organized house. But sometimes I just have to be like, you know what? It'll get taken care of. Even though it does still irk me a little bit, it's okay, I'll live if my house is messy for a few days. All right, so the girls and I finished having lunch. Nelson is actually out and about with Achilles. They're getting a few errands and they just bought, I believe, Achilles um, Halloween costume, so. All the kids' costumes are taken care of. We're just waiting for the girls to arrive in the mail. That's out of the way, thank goodness. Um, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tidy this place up because I've gotta take my final shots for my Christmas DIYs that I just created for tomorrow. <clears throat> the living room is a mess. So I gotta get started on that. At least I ate. We're all full. 
the girls are on their tablets having some tablet time and um, gotta get going. So we just picked up some Wendy's and I happened to drive by the kids school that they used to attend. It is one and it's one hour and 20 minutes until the kids get let out. And there is already a car rider line out there. One hour and 20 minutes before the school lets out and there's already parents in line. Let me tell you something. That is one thing I don't miss. I don't miss it. You guys ready to eat? Yeah. yeah. Right, and anyways, go. we're already done. We don't have to do like seven hours of schoolwork. I know, right? We get done pretty fast, don't we? I know. Yeah, we do. And we get to have lunch at home with you. And we can watch on our tablet. Yeah. Going down. All right. <laughs> Let's go eat. <laughs> so I got me some new toys. <laughs> you know, this is a regular axe you know to if you want to cut a tree down and this is a splitting axe so it's not really a maul so you know mauls are bigger have a lot more weight but this is kind of a in between the axe and the maul so you get to go out there and play in the woods in the fall and in the winter So one of the errands that Nelson was running was getting me five white candles from Hobby Lobby. It's a good thing they're half off. Um, but I need this for my video because I have a candelabra that I remade and I didn't have enough candles for it. So he had to run out there and get these for me. Something else that he picked up was this gold um, art project tape. We need this for one of our homeschool lessons along with some little um, bees. We're gonna do a fun little project because we're learning about Egypt and their jewelry and what they used to wear. So this will be a fun little art project for us. Okay, so the living room is nice and clean. I got all my DIYs videotaped. That pillow's on the floor because my son was laying down on there. Um, he's gonna come back in just a few minutes. I sent him to take a shower. <laughs> so he'll come back and get some more tablet time on the couch, but everything is nice and clean and organized and it will not stay like this at all. But I'm kind of happy with how everything looks right now. That random chair right there, that's one of my homeschool chairs. I don't have space for it upstairs right now where it's supposed to go because we're still fixing up the space, so it's just kind of there. But everything else looks really good and I'm if I sound like I'm out of breath it's because I just ran up the basement stairs <laughs> but I do like how everything is looking so far um I did wash this and it did get a lot less itchy I think if I throw it in there one more time it'll do the trick but 
It feels so much better than what it did before. And I think it goes perfect with the pillows that I had made. And yes, if you are wondering, I still have those curtains up and I have not tried the blue ones yet. I just haven't had time. <laughs> it's been a couple weeks since I bought them, I think, and I just have not had the chance to put those up. I'm gonna see if I can today. I got some tidying up to do in the kitchen on the island and I gotta get stuff prepared for dinner because Nelson is actually out with the girls. They have their soccer practice today. So the boy is the only one that's with me. If I can get this area cleared up a little bit, tidied up while I make dinner, <laughs> I am gonna try and see if I can go ahead and change those because I'm liking how everything looks so far with the touches that I got. And all the DIYs are already throughout the living room. I'm sure you saw some of them, but you'll see this the day after that video goes live, so it's okay. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna see if I can go ahead and put those up to see what they look like. Since I have several pieces throughout that I will be using for my Christmas decor, that way I can go ahead and see if everything kind of coordinates. So crossing my fingers that I can get that done. All right, so I went ahead and ironed both sets and I have two on either side. I think they look pretty good. Again, totally different from anything that I've ever done, but they give the home kind of like a more traditional um, old world feel, I guess. Um, but I do like it with the darker pillows and um, just looking at the patterns right now. They look really pretty. I guess I'll have to take a video of them during the day because it is a little bit yellow since I have the yellow light right there from the lamp since it's dark outside, or at least it's getting dark outside. So I'll leave them up there for a couple of days and kind of see how I like them, but um, I think they look really pretty. Let me know what you think. So the evening kind of got away from us after Nelson got home. Girls got bathed from their soccer practice. We had dinner and then now Nelson is about to clean the kitchen for me while I go upstairs and edit my videos. So that way um, I can get started on that as quickly as possible. It takes quite a bit of time to edit my DIY videos. So hopefully I'm not up too late tonight. Um, anything you want to say? <laughs> Look at this freaking, what is it? Frankenstein? Franken monster. So, Your Franken glasses? Frankenstein glasses. There we go. So this is an old pair of glasses. And then I was able to put <laughs> like a old, another. From another set. You put the side piece of another oh, set right. onto it. That's what you did. Right. So they're your glasses that you broke. But there's something that I have realized here. So like these were stylish. You know, look, look at that. Very sleek. But. When I look up, I can't see. I look down, I can't see. Have, you know, have I gotten to that old age where I was like, hey, I just want functionality. I want the glasses to be so huge <laughs> that I can look up or down and I'm good. That's not good. I'm not old yet. I know. It's creeping up. I know. It's I creeping up on you. That's what I it is. I don't like it. <laughs> At all. So he just had that realization this evening when he's talking about the type of glasses that he wants to order, which we still haven't done it yet, but that's another thing on our to-do list. <laughs> so yes, thank you guys for following along today. We'll see you back here tomorrow. Until then, adios.